Hey, what's up guys? Uh, Scald here. Um, video today, I thought I'd bring you uh, some uh, a review of some filament I've been using lately. Uh, here we have all the colours this company uh, does um, in PLA. Uh, PLA is the only, the only filament they um, manufacture and I must say it is some really nice PLA. Uh, the reason I found the company is that uh, when I bought my ANA A, I bought a, a quite, I spent, uh, I think it must be nearly 20 quid on a cheap roll of uh, orange PLA from Amazon. And it was an orange, and as you can see, the, the, this is what is more yellow than orange, especially compared to this orange from uh, 3D uh, quality filament here in the UK. Is so much better. Um, uh, I can't remember how. I think I just came across them on Facebook, and um, I originally bought uh, bought a roll of their black and a black uh, and their white. Um, yeah, a roll of their black and a roll of their white. As um, I'm using them for my Core X Y printers that I'm building in the process of building out of uh, two A8 A8 printers. Um, and yeah, it's some, it's some really nice filament. The colours really good. Prints really well. I've been printing uh, all of these between 185 and 190 degrees on the high end, and between 50 and 60 degrees on the bed. And they're really nice. Um, so I actually ran out my first roll of black on the corners for my Core X Y machine, as you can see here. These are the these are the corners I've been doing. Um, Really nice plastic, um, real, it goes down really well and layers up quite nicely. Um, so yeah, so I had to buy some more black, so I bought, uh, since I've run out of the first roll of black on literally the corners of the frame for the Core XY, I decided that I'll buy two rolls of the black and two rolls of the white, because the other Core XY is going to be uh, white corners and white plastic. So that's what I did, and I've been talking to him on Facebook, um, and I'm talking to him, I said, um, look, I just did an order, can you throw in a bunch of your, the samples of your other colours, and that's what they did. Um, I've actually got them all here. This is just, this is how they come. Get a bit of Haribo in some of them. But, um, I had to open the box, and it was the orange that really caught my eye. So these are the, as you can see, these are like the last offcuts of some of these. Um, but yeah, so you get one sample per one spool of uh, filament that you get boxed up. But yeah, this is the the ten colours they do. We've got uh, utility green. I've been um, uh, printing off stickers to go on the back just so I know because these are like my swatches sort of thing for colours and stuff. So that's a uh, utility green. Which is quite a nice green. The orange is what I mostly like. Uh, orange is my favourite colour, so yeah, so what. So it's really nice to see a real nice. It's a they call it a tangy orange. And then we've got an electric purple, which is really nice. I forgot a, another sample actually. I need to see if I can fr uh, print out a uh, flexi rexy for my daughter, as that's what she wants. Um, these ones, I didn't actually have enough sample filament left to finish the this design. Um, this is a uh, Philobots. It's more of a, a calibration design more than anything, but I like it because it's got like it's quite nice. It's got a hexagon and everything. Just helps lay down the on the printer, and also just shows that the printer's not out of alignment or anything some of these printed out really well but yeah obviously there's no if you look at this th i'm not sure if i can bring it up look at th that's probably the wrong color to use Let's try that one as you can see it's got a bit more thickness to it than this one um camera angle's a bit odd but yeah the colors are amazing they're really vibrant really nice colors um these two are the ones that i got in samples and in the sample packets, they look extremely similar. Let me see if I've got. Let me see. Um, that's the grey. We've got a bit of silver left. I think that's 
that's, uh, that's black. Oh, here we go. See how quite similar they are actually on the spools. I actually look quite different in the, on the camera actually. But this is silver, this is the battleship grey. And they, they turned up and they were like on top of one another and I was like, wow, they look extremely similar. But printed them out. Oh, and I want printed them out and I you can actually see there is a major difference between them. Which is quite nice. So this is the, the battleship grey and this is their Midnight Silver, so I'm so glad I put the names on the back. Um, and they're really nice. They, they um, print really well. This is their latest colour they brought out. It's a treasure gold, so it's like a, like an antique gold colour, which would be quite nice for like cosplay stuff and now I suppose. But it's nice, really strong. Uh, we've got sky blue, the signal red. The red's quite a nice one. Um, my Planning on to get probably a roll of each to print off a, a bunch of stuff for. Uh, I'm planning on doing a stall at my uh, children's summer fair uh, to come in July and take out one of the printers so the kids can see it and stuff. Just want to print off a, a bunch of stuff, so I'm gonna have to try and get get a spool of these nice colours and vibrant colours and just print off a load of stuff to give away and such. Just to get the kids in, like, excited and something for them to see. Um, but yeah, other than that, this is a nice company. They're friendly, nice to talk to. Um, they're only £12.99 for a kilo roll delivered, uh, which is really good. That was another reason why I went with them because they were cheap. Well, not, not cheap, cheap, but that, I just needed some more filament and. They were a good price, they fitted into what I could afford on filament at the time. And they're brilliant, they're really nice. They um helpful, friendly. Filament's good, nice colours. Um they come on cardboard and metal rolls like this, uh thirty five mil axle in the middle. So these are really uh, recyclable. Uh, a lot lighter than hang on. Oh, nearly dropped the frame. A lot lighter than, than these plastic rolls, ABS plastic rolls that we used to, uh, I got with the one I got of Hamzen, obviously uh, a lot more other people. But I use these cardboard ones, which are much easier to recycle. Just go straight in our recycling bin here in the UK. And yeah, they just, they're really nice. So this, this actually weighs a lot less than this, so you actually tend to get a Maybe a bit more filament, um, which is always nice. They're they're a kilo net weight, so what are they saying? Whip, mm, a little bit out. But yeah, they're um, so kilo rolls. So with that being a, a lighter spindle, you seem to get a bit more plastic for it. See, these weigh about 200 grams. This is probably only half that. If so, you maybe get another 50, 100 grams of filament, which is nice. Like I said, um, how did they get delivered? Hang on. So this is how they get delivered in a just a box like this. Label on the side of what colour it is, what material it is. Uh, they don't actually do ABS, as far as I know. I think they've literally got the one extruder that I know. Um, but yeah, it's a uh, 3D QF, 3D quality filament. Um, it's really good. It comes. They don't come backpack. That's one thing that I'm a bit worried about. But they come, just come in a bag sealed with desiccant, um, clip holding it on, which is great. Um, on their label, they've got uh, extrusion temp 180 to 210. I found best between 185 and 190. Um, and it prints really well with uh, between 50 and 60 on the bed, depending on what colour. That uh, does seem to affect what bed temperature and what adherence it is. Um, I think I've got, yeah, I've got a bit of, uh, I don't know if we can get it in the camera. Focus, no. No, 
not going to poke us. That's a cheap webcam for you. Um, but as you can see, the white is quite white. The black is black, which is nice. There's no, but yeah, these are some really nice vibrant colours. When I actually opened the box for the to see the samples just laid on the top, they I was amazed. It was the orange that attracted my eye, just how vibrant it is compared to something like this, which is not orange. No way near being orange compared to that. There's a big difference. So yeah, these are so if you're in basically if you're in the UK and you want good priced PLA for good which is good quality supporting the environment by using cardboard um, spools which is easily recyclable compared to these these aren't that recyclable um, but yeah um, but I'll leave links in the description to 3dqf um, you can go check them out for yourselves perhaps order some um, but yeah um, I'm gonna be ordering some colors Probably, probably at least a roll of each of these, just so I can. Um, the kids are going to be more enticed by those colours than these plainer ones. But yeah, that's um. Uh, also, print out a little Stegosaurus articulated one. Anyway, off topic. But yeah, filament's good. Um, really easy to print with. I really like it, it's uh, a nice nice filament. Um, I bought the rolls themselves, obviously samples are samples, they just come in a box. Um, they weren't expecting a review or anything from me, but I thought I'd um, get a word out there. So this is um, my filament review for this company. This is the only filament I've actually got at the moment, because um, I'm trying to print out these uh, corners and 3D parts for these 3D printers, which will be a series on of converting my uh, my current ANA A8 and another purchase ANA A8 to Core XYs which I will do a live stream for the first one uh, be about three weeks time by the time I print all the black parts out for the first one and I actually purchased the other ANA A8 so if you want to see that uh, subscribe down the bottom hit the bell and um, I'll leave links to 3DQF and also to Philobot's uh, design on Thingiverse. Um, I've started using this as just as a, a swatch because they just thought they can all go together and I can hook them all up. And I can just see they're just nice. Nice. You can see the stringiness and stuff of it, so it's really good. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have to get some more colours of these ones. White I'll print out because I've got the rolls. And I just need to get red and blue, and then I can just print out four ones of these. Uh, I ran out of filament for these. Not by much, but it was enough for them not to finish. Um, but yeah, anyway, so I uh, hope everyone has a good day and always be well and have fun in what you do. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.